Major infrastructural works to repair the recently damaged Pirara Bridge in Region 9 will begin soon. Minister within the Ministry of Public Works, Honorable Diodat Indar, made this announcement following an inspection of the bridge on Friday. He was accompanied by Minister of Local Government and Regional Development, Honorable Nigel Darmlan, and a team of regional officials. Minister Indar explained how the works will be undertaken. The bridge will take one week once the materials are here. From what I'm seeing, they have 18 piles need to be replaced. The water is low, now is the best time to replace it. But that is not the issue. Pirara alone is not the issue. We have bridges all over has been, be, be been destroyed by heavy laden trucks. Minister Indar is urging those who traverse the hinterland regions to be responsible to avoid future incidences. We are trying to make sure that the infrastructure that we take taxpayers' monies and put here, that it is scared. You know, and we are, we are also cognizant of the fact that we don't want the costs for the bridge, you know, the, the, the um, we call it the engineering estimates to be bloated and all of those things. So that's why sometimes we come and actually check how much piles are going in. Actually, that's what we're here to see how much piles are going in, how long we are going to extend the bridge along the Chudanani, what are the, um, the flat members, the the um, decking is going to be like. All those things we come and check for ourselves. Minister Indar says charges will be laid against the truck driver who damaged the bridge further after temporary works were undertaken. He noted that this needs to be done since such actions are callous and selfish. I myself have called the, um, the Deputy Commissioner of Police and asked to institute charges on, on those people. Because there need to be some kind of, you know, responsibleness. I mean, we, we are all we are citizens of the same country. The money that we spend here is not is your money, my money, minister's money, the guy behind the all of us pay taxes. That is the money spent here. And we can't have two or three people, you know, behaving, you know, in this manner. We, we have to put a stop to it. On April 11, the southern section of the 210-foot wooden structure collapsed after a heavy-duty truck attempted to cross the bridge, which serves as a link between Lethem and Anai.